The word asana literally means a posture. When we say a posture, every posture the body can take is an asana. Now this is an asana, 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 this is an asana. So how many possible innumerable possible? Innumerable postures that this body can take, of the innumerable postures that this body can take, we identified eighty-four asanas as yogasanas. These eighty-four postures are possibilities where your body will not sit as a hurdle in front of you, but act as a channel for your ultimate possibility. What is the biggest barrier for the human beings to do whatever they're doing? It is their body and their mind. What should have been a stepping stone has turned into an obstacle simply because we have not explored it considerably. Yogasana means you're taking charge of your life, you're transforming your body and mind into a possibility, not a barrier in your life. It is becoming a passage, it is not a block. For every emotional, psychological and different levels of consciousness that you experience, your body naturally tends to take a certain posture. That is, if you're angry, you'll sit one way. You're peaceful, you sit another way. You're in turmoil, you sit one way. You're tranquil, you sit another way. Like this, if you observe your own life, you will see for different states of consciousness that you experience, your body tends to take certain postures. Based on this, conversely is the science of asanas. By consciously getting your body into a certain posture, you can also elevate your consciousness. The very way you think, feel, perceive and understand life can be altered simply because of the way you sit. Physical body is the easiest thing to work with. If you try to do something with your mind, it will play too, it will play too many tricks. At least with the body, you know whether it's doing it right or not doing it right, whether it's cooperating or not cooperating. A mind, if you push it too hard, it will play all kinds of tricks with you. It will make you believe all kinds of things and dump you the next day. But body is not like that. It is a reliable factor. If you work with it sensibly, yoga sinas will definitely lead to the possibility of ultimate union. Ability to concentrate is, you know, much better. I notice a difference in terms of my productivity at work. My energy levels have definitely gone up a lot since practicing Hatha Yoga. Once I kind of settled into the posture, there's just like this amazing feeling that comes over me and, and it lasts through the day. It's like this clarity. Physically, I actually injured my back uh, two years ago. I had a pinched nerve in my uh, lower spine. Doing the asanas, uh, within two weeks, I immediately knew a difference. I couldn't even touch my toes. I couldn't even think about touching my toes before. I couldn't sit with my legs in front of me and bend forward without arching my back. I, I couldn't do any of that stuff. And on the physical side, it's just changed so much. I, I just feel, I feel better now than I ever have in my life. I wish I would have started this, you know, when I was a teenager. The practice of yogasanas provides countless benefits, including relief of chronic ailments, preparation of body and mind towards a higher possibility, slowing down of the aging process,